Hi everyone, so today we're going to talk about the most awaited feature of EZB, which was the HubSpot integration. So you can activate HubSpot integration by clicking on the integrations icon that you see here. Once you click on the integrations icon, you'll see the screen. You can click on the connection icon, follow the few steps and connect your HubSpot account. Make sure that your admin has given you enough permissions to connect your WhatsApp account to your HubSpot account. After connecting your HubSpot account, you'll see an icon over here just like this one. This tells you that your HubSpot has been connected successfully. After you have connected your HubSpot, you click on the HubSpot icon and whatever chat you have open, you can now connect and transfer information about this chat into HubSpot. Now you have two options. The first option is you can link this contact to an already created HubSpot contact or you can create a new contact inside HubSpot. So these are the two options. You can either create a new contact or you can link an existing HubSpot contact. So let's say we link an existing HubSpot contact. Let's say we decide to link Maria to this number. So let's say we click on the link button. Now let's go back to HubSpot and see whether this linkage has happened successfully or not. So as you can see, Maria HubSpot has been successfully linked and this is the number that has been updated on HubSpot. Let's go back to WhatsApp and see what else can we do with this contact. So the three options that you see here after the contact has been created or synced with HubSpot are the user profile, tasks and notes section. So user profile consists of the user profile with user properties that are there on HubSpot. Whatever information you update here will automatically get updated on HubSpot. Now the second option is the tasks option. Whatever task you create or update inside WhatsApp, it will get completely synced with your HubSpot. So let's try this and see how it works. Let's create a HubSpot task. Let's say follow up with him tomorrow. Let's create a sample task. Let's create it for 7th March. And now let's just go to HubSpot and see how this task has been created inside HubSpot. Let's go to HubSpot. This is how the HubSpot interface looks like. And if we just refresh, just look at this. So if we just refresh this and we can see the task option, we can see the follow up task has already been created. So it is a complete sync. Now let's come back to WhatsApp and we can create as many tasks as we want. We can not only sync them with HubSpot, you can also refer them to in WhatsApp again if you want. So all the tasks that you've created with respect to this contact can be seen inside WhatsApp over here. Now let's move on to the third section, which is your notes section. So you can create notes over here. So let's create a note with respect to a client. In the notes can create any kind of note that you would like to log with respect to a particular client. It can contain any information with respect to a particular client. Let's say the client asks me to follow up tomorrow. The client asks me to meet tomorrow. It can be anything. So let's say I write something. Yeah, the client asked me to follow up tomorrow. And let's say I save this. So now this is a note that I have created and I have saved this. Now this is a note that I have logged and this note will now be saved inside HubSpot. Let's go to HubSpot and see whether this note is now saved. Let's refresh. So we can see that it has come inside the note section. The client asked me to follow up tomorrow. So whatever you sync from WhatsApp, it automatically gets logged in inside your HubSpot screen. Now let's go back to WhatsApp. So the last thing that we'd like to show you is a feature wherein you can also log your WhatsApp conversation inside HubSpot. So how you can do that is using the attach WhatsApp messages feature. Clicking on attach WhatsApp messages, you'll get a screen like this. You can select the first message by clicking on any message that you want. Then you can select the last message that you want. And then the it will automatically, if you click on done, it will automatically select all the messages. If you can scroll and see all the messages in between will get selected between all the, between the charts that you've selected. And all these messages will get logged inside HubSpot. So what we've just shown you is there's a two-way sync between WhatsApp and HubSpot. You can update your user profile, you can update your tasks, and you can also update your follow-up notes directly from WhatsApp. Not only this, you can also log your WhatsApp conversations directly from WhatsApp into your HubSpot. So the central point is you need not visit the HubSpot interface anymore. You can do everything directly from WhatsApp. So I hope you like this feature. Do give it a shot. We have a seven day trial period available for the team's plan. Please give it a try and do let us know if you face any issue. Happy to help. Thank you for your time.